The soul's like all matter. Why would it stay intact, stay faithful to its one form when it could be free? Beautiful lines, isn't it? Beautiful just like the author, poetic genius Louis Elizabeth Kluke, the American poet who won the Nobel Prize for Literature of 2020. She is the 16th woman who won Nobel Prize for Literature. She is awarded Nobel Prize for her unmistakable poetic voice that with austere beauty makes individual existence universal. The Swedish Academy compared her to 19th century American poet Emily Dickinson. Gluck is known for her poetry's technical precision, sensitivity and insight into loneliness, family relationships, divorce and death. Her poems are symbol and they portray the severity of human conditions and depth of family relationships. She used myths with novelty in her poems unlike other American poets. She was born on April 22, in 1943 in New York. After attending Sarah Lawrence College and Columbia University, Gluck taught poetry at numerous colleges and universities including Harvard and Yale. Her first book of poetry is First Born, which was published in 1968. The House on Marshland, published in 1975. The Garden, 1976. The Descending Figure, 1980. The Triumph of Achilles, 1985. Ararat, 1990. The Wild Iris, 1992. Meadowlands, 1996. Vita Nova, 1999. The Seven Ages, 2001. Averno, 2006. A Village Life 2009, Poems 1962 to 2012, which was published in 2012, are some of her books on poetry. Faithful and Virtuous Night, published in 2014, is her recent collection. American Originality, published in 2017, Proofs and Theories, published in 1994, are her collection of essays. Other than Nobel Prize, Gluck has won National Humanities Medal in 2015, Ballard Stephens Award 2008, Bollingen Prize 2001, National Book Critics Circle Award 1985. She has also won Pulitzer Prize for The Wild Diaries published in 1992. In 2003, Gluck was named the 12th U.S. Poet Laureate.